Unlike other college students, ArtCon majors spend their days painting, drawing, and handling art. Founded in 1971, ArtCon at UD is the only undergraduate program of its kind offered in the nation. Classes like ArtCon 464 offer students invaluable experience to prepare them for a one-of-a-kind career in conservation. And on the first day of class, I brought in a bunch of terracotta flower pots, which is sort of like how you start in ceramics conservation. That's like the first thing that you do. Um, and we actually broke them, and they created a fill out of plaster, and then sort of in-painted that to match the surrounding terracotta. Using their knowledge from breaking and repairing clay pots, the students were able to use their new skills on historic objects from the Winterthur Museum study collection. Students complete extensive research and create treatment proposals that are then applied to their objects. The object that I'm focusing on is a 19th century oyster plate. Um, it's a really cool piece. So this is like a specialty item that was specifically made for serving oysters. So um, it, the overall shape of the plate is um, an oyster shell um, kind of yeah shape and then there's wells on the plate that you will place the oysters in and serve to your dinner guests. So it's very special, very fancy. Um, and then the general design on the plate all has to do with um, the theme of like sea creatures. So there's a lobster claw, there's a little crab, there's some seaweed, so it's very interesting. Students chose from a host of artifacts ranging in age and problems to solve. This piece is decorated with multiple colors and different enamels and glazed over in a typical ceramic glaze. And when I received the piece, there was a chunk missing out of the rim. So what I did was I created a plaster fill and I am now trying to match the colors as best as I can so I can fill in the missing design. With a foundation of practical knowledge under their belts, these future conservators are one step closer to becoming quiet heroes of history. For 49 News, I'm Chelsea Hogan.